Welcome back. It's Friday, August 14, 2020. Uh, joining the conversation this morning is Nicole Jordan Martin, Executive Director and Chief Executive Officer of Community Care at New York City Health and Hospitals. Good morning, Nicole. How are you? Hi, good morning, JR. I'm doing very well. Thank you. So glad to have you back. Uh, JRG Entertainment and Caribbean Power Jam is partnering with New York City Health and Hospitals to provide amazing resources. We are informing our audience and the communities about this every week because it's so important. The resources are there for us, they're there for you, and we want you guys to be aware of it. So, uh, hi, good morning, Nicole. Hi, good morning, Jair. I can hear you. So, uh, could we um, elaborate on some key things that we could touch on? <laughs> Um, sure. Good morning again, everyone in the panel. Um, thank you for having me in the program again today. Um, so every week uh, I do uh, spend time reminding all New Yorkers about the many resources uh, through our um, programs and services here at New York City Health and Hospitals, um, as well as New York City Test and Trace um, Initiative. Uh, so primary um, is testing, um, you know, for which we have many, many testing sites across the city. We continue to encourage everyone to know their COVID status, um, either through uh, viral testing, which uh, gives you information about whether or not you're currently infected, um, and antibody testing, which will give you information about whether or not you've been infected previously. Um, we encourage you to take the test, know your status, um, if you need support isolating um, or safely separating from those that you live with, uh, there are many uh, services that we have to support you in that regard. Um, chief among that is our hotel program, um, which is free. Um, we remind everyone to call 844-NYC-4NYC or 844-692-4692 um, to ask about a free hotel room. Um, if you can safely um, separate or isolate at home, um, we do have services um, as well, calling that same number um, to help you do that at home, including supplies for infection prevention and control, um, meal delivery, um, assistance with medication delivery, um, with pet services, um, whatever your needs are, um, and just daily monitoring and support. Um, the program is now providing free pulse oximeters so that individuals who are uh, impacted by COVID, uh, they can monitor their oxygen saturation levels um, and report that information uh, regularly um, and be encouraged and have access to medical care um, if that is indicated as a result of their pulse oximetry uh, monitoring. Um, we also want to remind everyone, um, Dr. Nantamuti, I'm so thankful that you're addressing the mental health um, concerns um, here in the Community Care Division of New York City Health and Hospitals. We work very closely with Dr. Nusimorti and her team at Kings County, as well as all of our healthcare um, facilities um, across this health system, all of our hospitals. Um, we have a program um, called uh, Care Management or Care Coordination um, for uh, individuals who are impacted by behavioral health uh, issues. And in particular, um, our focus is really to help them navigate access to the services that they need. Um, it is overwhelming, um, and oftentimes uh, these individuals are just uh, really having a difficult time understanding how to access services to address their mental health and substance use issues, um, and also you know, how to really navigate those services once they're aware of where they are. So our program, um, can also provide support for escorting someone to their appointments, um, to help provide support um, so that they can see their doctor, get the care that they need, um, and to also continue to help them manage all the activities um, in their lives, uh, help them learn how to navigate every day That's on their own mind. without being overwhelmed. Um, so it's very, very important. Um, Dr. Anuntamorti provided the number to Kings County. Those, that number can also connect to our services 
um, as well, um, where we're really helping long-term uh, individuals really navigate their mental health, substance use, and their medical um, care, uh, and services that they, they need to help keep them healthy and well while they're in the community. Okay, uh, thank you, Nicole. Uh, Nicole, we would like you to stick around because we're going to come back to you because we're going to be talking about Kamala Harris's historic moment in this nation. <laughs> 